All right, let me go with that 17. One second. All right. Is he really starting my red this game? All right, now I just need to hope that Graves doesn't do his level 2 cringe invade. Okay, nice. What are you eating? It was a uh, pasta with sausages. All right, listen. I think my biggest play right now is just like full clear and then try for a bot gank right after. Because then we bots like a perma shove lane. <sighs> yeah, cause why wouldn't the Graves skip his fucking blue? Why wouldn't the Graves just skip his blue to get to the crab first? Even though crab gives half the fucking XP? That blue buff does, why not? See, the thing is, I could go for wolves here, but I think that's actually better. Mid has shove, we can try this here. Why not, bro? Why not? Just why not? Like, <sighs> it's just so disturbing. I have mid prior, so I can probably look for an invade here. Ah, never mind. Karma killed me. Fuck. Why was Karma top mid? Cause support, bro. The way the support world works nowadays is that you don't need to do it. You don't need to have a brain. You just run around the map and you win. Uh, of course the Seraphine has fucking TP. And flashes, why not? Flashes too. Every flash in the game with ignites, with uh, with teleports flying in, like, just why not? You know the funniest thing too about this game is? The enemy support is action ADC main. But he understands that all he has to do is run around the fucking map. And he's actually up a level on the Malka that hasn't left lane all game. Imagine how crazy it is. And this role isn't getting gutted anytime soon. It's so fucking pathetic. Nice. Nice, well played. Is there again? Oh, my bad. Let's cook. Yeah, why wouldn't Karma be there again? And then, of course, the enemy ADC. Eh, zero dots. Why not? Hasn't been in lane all game and a level up. How crazy is it? I mean, if you're playing support and your ADC locks in a fucking wave clearing mage, I don't know why you'd ever slip out to be in with. Yeah, why not? Of course, of course Karma's there again, why not? Why not, Why wouldn't Karma be there again, guys? Literally the most inflated role in the entire game without without a doubt right now. Well. Nice, bro. Nice, worth. Mm. I think this game I have to do like opportunity into serpents and full lethality. I mean, realistically, what do you expect me to do on this, bro? Like, my Malka is trying to 1v1 the Seraphine mid and shove out mid wave. I, I don't know what to say. Is this guy fucking autofilled? I really hope he is. <sighs> you 
You gotta win this one? Yeah, I mean, it's just gonna be hard. Like, the enemy support just left lane all game while our support was AFK bot, and now me and the mid laner are super far behind because of him. I mean, the guy didn't even press Q. If he could have queued the ASOL towards the fucking uh, turret, then I could have vaulted him under to the tower. Uh, the only shit thing about this game is I'd really want to get mid prowl, but it's like they just locked in Seraphine. Haha, <laughs> so she just one shots the wave, and there's nothing we can do. Look at this. Look at this skill, guys, with the champ. One shot the wave as soon as it spawns. Damn. Okay, I mean, Renekton's alive. If we can actually wipe this here, it's huge. Perfect. Nice. I mean, listen, 4 for 3 isn't the worst. Seraphine is a permanent stain on the history of the game. Now, I'm telling you, the problem is that they just seem nuke the fuck out of that champion's, like, Q and E AP ratio, and then just buff her, like, heal and shield. You should never, ever, ever be able to play an enchanter as an ADC and then draft double enchanter. That should never be a thing. Good. Baron, no. No, my Renekton doesn't TP. He's really been my best performer this game. Good. Vayne is a good mid lane champ. What? But this game's like <laughs> literally his fault. Well, so on the bright side, I get my serpent stuff. But that might actually have a moral reminder of this game too. Fiddle one trick. Fiddle one trick playing support. Fiddle one trick playing support winning. Nice. Nice. Because he just leaves bot level 2 and then never goes back to lane. While the enemy lane is AFK. It's, it's just like so cringe. I don't know. It's just so insanely cringe. Nice. A team fight burst AoE CC. Insane wave clear plus healer and shielder champ. That's really good fucking game design from Riot. At least Sona, the only reason why that champ's even like someone balanced is because her Q only damages like two targets. You know what I mean? Imagine Sona Q damage everything in the radius around her. That's like the level of broken that Seraphine is. See, the issue is if I try killing Graves, <coughs> he just crits me for 1k and I die in two autos. Alright, well, listen, good news is I just got Mortal Reminder.
can one. Oh, she actually. Oh, I don't know. She landed her on me. Never mind. We lost. Guys, dude, when are they gonna nerf support? <sighs> Fun game. Who wants to laugh? Who wants to laugh? Who here wants to laugh? Who wants to laugh? Who wants to laugh? Oh, now you guys are about to laugh. Oh my god, the laughs are about to come in. Out of base. Look where she goes. Just around this mid. Shoves out of wave bot resets. Does she walk bot here? Clears boards. That's collapsed on by me. Dies. Oh, where does she walk out of base here? Oh, towards mid again. Nice. Another mid play. Cool. Walk around base. Resets. Where does she walk now, guys? Where does she walk now? Oh, walks mid again. Keep in mind, this is nine minutes into the game, correct? Nine minutes into the game. All right. Now let's watch our Maokai's POV. Shall we? Let's watch Maokai's POV. Tries helping, dies. It happens. Walks straight bot out of base. <laughs> yep, that's my support, baby. Respawns, where does he walk out of base? Bot. Oh, that's my fucking support, baby. I got a pick. Walks out of base. Nine minutes. Now, guys, yes or no? Was Maokai bot lane 89% of the game? Was Maokai bot lane infinitely more time than Karma was? Yes, he was, right? Of course. Okay, cool. So why the fuck is he down the level? You know what this genuinely fucking reminds me of? This level of disgusting, brain-dead, broken cancer. You know what it fucking reminds me of? It reminds me of the jungle meta where you lock in Elise every game, right? Elise or any other strong level 3 champ. And then they would sit there and they would just get level 3, gank, reset, gank, reset, gank. And then Riot literally had to nerf the fuck out of kill XP for, for junglers. And minion XP and minion gold. In order to make it somewhat balanced. What nerf still I support getting? Minus six gold! I don't know! What? Three thousand gold! Worth of stats! In a free item! What do junglers get? A 200 health shield that gives them 10% tenacity for a second when it expires. <sighs> Unbelievable bullshit fucking cancer that we are experiencing this season. Unbe fucking leaveable. It really is. <sighs> Like, it's really just so gross to experience. So insane.